Good morning everyone, hope you're doing well. It's a little bit after six. I was up, I was up before the sun this morning. The sky looked pretty over there. It had all like that candy floss, green, uh, pink stripes, but I was gonna go out and take some video of it, but I think it was more behind the houses so it wouldn't have done it justice. But anyway guys, I hope you have a great weekend. I hope you have a brilliant day. It's supposed to be pretty nice today. Oh, they're talking about the tribute. 9-11, it's coming around quick again, isn't it? Crazy. Anyway, guys, I hope you have a wonderful it's day. nice being out here when it's quiet. At 8 o'clock on the dot, though, I heard some workmen starting. As you can see, it's kind of overcast. But that's, oh no, it's kind of blue. If you look above the house, blue's breaking through. There's a horrible bug over there. I think they call them stink bugs or something. Okay guys, it's beautiful today. It is 10.30. Oh, let's put my watch on. Ash and I are heading for Ashley to have her nails done. She's going to the city tonight, aren't you? Yes. With a mask. Yes. You have to wear it on the train and stuff. And then we're going to drop off the packages because the guy never picked up yesterday. And when I called, post office their excuse was their internet was down and everybody's go yeah everybody's gone now i'm like yeah the same excuse last time he didn't pick up and then how she wants to return some clothes to calls get perfume from ulta and go to home goods and then wegmans if i definitely want to do oh and i gotta drop avon books off to a lady so try and fit it all in Recording. It's a busy town today. People saying, Dad was saying that on the highway yesterday coming home, it was like commuter traffic all over again on a Friday. Let me show you this parking job. She backed in, looked at it, got back in, got back out. And left. <laughs> Ash has her black nails. Ready shut, for Salem. Yep, yeah, she's going to Salem next Saturday. Um, so. We're off now to do some other errands. What time is it? 12 o'clock? 12.02. So that was good. She took it a bit early. It was busy when we got there. I thought, oh, that's why I said, okay, for me to stay. I would have just gone and... I don't know what I would have done, actually. Taken your car and driven around the block. If we were in the parking lot, I would have got in the car. But there, I would be afraid of people. Some drew seats, I think. Yeah. So I was like, oh, I'll just pay for someone to drive my car. And <laughs> sit in the back. There. Guys, I cannot believe this massive building they've put here. It used to be all greenery, but now they've put up a big parking lot, I guess, for the commuters. I guess the town's getting overrun with people. There's more houses going up. Anyway, it's quite warm. It's 82. Not as humid, so that's okay. okay. Ash and I didn't do um, home goods because there was an actual wait and there wasn't when we parked but then when we came out of calls there was a, a line to go in so we changed our mind so. so here we are here's our new Wegmans right up the street from where we live okay guys so we dropped the Avon book off we did Wegmans and now we're heading home are we gonna have pizza or are you not having anything if you're not I might just heat up some of the quesadillas I don't know, I'll have to have a look. Oh, you, what train are you taking? I don't know yet. Oh. Well, there's no point cooking it if you're not having any and Dad's yeah. not having any, so. I'll just have something like, like chips. <laughs> you should drop Joanna book off as well sometime. So, oh, they got lights on inside that part now. It's all bricked up. So there's the high school, long time no see. See the field again. Yep. So maybe all those things are staying off of it now. I'm just a loser. Is that what they said? What kind of accent is that? I'm just a loser. Now we're going to see Miss Calm go to Miss Wild. Hi, Luna. Luna! She's like, are you getting out? <laughs> okay guys, we're home. It is t uh, quarter to two. 
Um, I thought Ash might have pizza or something, but she is actually getting ready to leave now to go into the city. They're meeting at four o'clock at Times Square, so off she pops. Um, my head is still pounding. Just took something from my bag. I think she's on FaceTime with him again. He calls a lot. Just talking about Halloween. Um, Pete's still working on the car. He was working on the car when we left and he's working on the car now. So Luna is in with Ashley right now. She went ballistic the minute we pulled in. We couldn't even come through the gate. We ended up going up through the basement so that we could get in the door without being mauled. But uh, she's calm now. So I'm gonna watch some TV. I'm gonna make a sandwich in a minute. I just need to calm down a minute. I'm so hot and tired. And like I said, uh, my head, but I promised Ash I would go. So I went with her to nails. So I'll, I'll be going next week. Uh, I got my appointment for 11 o'clock. The girl came over, she goes, let me see your nails. How are they holding up? I was like, they're good, they're good. <laughs> so she was happy. Um, I said, I'm gonna go with white next week. And she laughed. She goes, not black like Ashley. Ashley has black. I said, no. And Ashley will not come with me next week because she will be in Massachusetts. Massachusetts. Um, she is going with a couple of fr uh, two friends, hopefully, but definitely one, over to Salem. Um, she loves Salem. She loves witches. So she's going off there. Now. That's why she had her nails done black this week, so she'll be all ready. So yeah, at least she's off today and tomorrow. My sister-in-law texted yesterday, they may have a little barbecue for Paige tomorrow because Paige leaves for school on Friday. I can't believe it. She's going to college. Um, could you, could you, squidgy little, tiny little Paige is not tiny little baby Paige anymore. She's grown up, beautiful lady Paige. <laughs> anyway, it, it's not set in stone. She said they haven't really discussed it much. They mentioned it in passing and just wanted to know if we were about if, if they did. So I said, we are. So anyway, guys, on that note, I'm going to love and leave you for a bit. I'm going to sit down for five, find something to watch. Um, everywhere we went was busy. Like I said, we were going to go into Home Goods, and then there was no line. And then when we went into Coles to return Ashley's clothes, we didn't even look around Coles. We literally went right downstairs to customer service. Um, Ash returned her clothes and then we came back out and as we were walking over to Home Goods, we're like, ah, there's a line and Ashley goes, forget it. So then we went to Wegmans, which was exciting, um, but packed, I couldn't believe there was no line outside and it was jammed in there. And Ashley said, I'm getting nervous. I'm like, mm, there's more people in here than I thought. And there was no direction that you had to go this way or that way. It's just such a massive, massive store. So barely did a quarter of it, just got the things that I really wanted, which was the quesadillas, the pizza, actually got some mozzarella sticks. We really didn't. I looked for my Mickey Mouse ice creams, but they were out. And this woman, two women just walked right in front of me like I wasn't even, I didn't even exist. I'm like, that isn't even six inches, lady. But um, I just, I said to Ash, let's go. And she goes, yeah, I think so. But I'm glad actually, because they're meeting earlier than she thought. She thought she was taking a four o'clock train. But now she's got to take a three something and it's already almost two. Anyway, that was a lot of chit chat. So I'll talk to you in a bit. Somebody's sulking. Are you sulking? Who's that, Luna? Pete's washing the carpet. Shampoo in the carpet. Pest. Someone's a pest. Yep, you do. I'm going for. No, get down. Quesadilla and some chips. You're being a bugger. Get down. Get down. Get down. Get down. She listens well, doesn't she? Get down. Pete's coming now. It's his seat. Anyway, and Pete's having meatloaf. The last of the meatloaf. He liked it that much.
Okay guys, it's only 20 past seven, but I'm gonna end the vlog because I'm not doing anything else. Pete's going in his office now to edit some pictures, the stuff that he took um, Wednesday and Thursday night over at the other place. He's got to edit all those. So he's gonna work on those tonight. He successfully fixed the car. Um, hopefully, oh, I didn't even tell you guys, but the car went, yeah, I did. The car went out again, couldn't use it all week. Uh, about 10 days now so he's fixed it he says it he reckons it should be good if it's not then it's a much bigger problem so if it's <laughs> if it's the cars are 2007 I said think on before we put it in for like a massive job uh, it doesn't come cheap anyway hopefully whatever he did and bought again he bought another part um, it works He's just taken Luna around the block. Dinner was amazing. Those quesadillas were so good. So good. Not overly stuffed. So that was good. Um, yeah, Ash is in the city having drinks somewhere. So she's having fun. Haven't heard of Dickie Bow, so that's always a good sign. No news is good news and all that. And I'm going to go over there now and watch some shows because there's no point going downstairs. Pete shampooed all the carpet downstairs anyway, so I want to leave it to dry properly, which I think it, it feels dry, but he's going to take Luna in his office with him because she likes to lay in there and he'll have the air conditioner on because the office is very hot, even though it's extremely breezy out. It's not that it's 76, but I think the humidity level is way low. It felt quite nice out there. Alexa, what's the humidity level? Right now, the humidity is 69%. Oh. It's higher than I thought. I, th I thought she literally was going to say in the 30s. But it felt nice sitting out on the deck. I mean, it's a, I'm a bit hot up here, but that's because the room's been closed off. I've got the fan on. It said 86 when I come up, and I think it's already gone down to 82 because it is lovely outside. But I don't want to sit outside anymore. I want to relax now. So we've got our errands done and all that good stuff, as you saw. So now it's time to use these lovely products. I've been, I've left them like this for now because I want to take them downstairs onto that table that Pete set up for me and take pictures. But I, oh, mm, I was going to buy a peony candle from Bath and Body Works because peony is the, one of the main ingredients in here. And I was going to set it up on the white and then I was going to try and pick up some peony flowers and make it all look pretty. But the, the candles go off sale today. Um, let me see, I'll think on because um, it's not like a candle that I would really want, but I would light it to do that just to make it look so pretty. You know, maybe I would just order that one candle. <laughs> it seems a bit silly ordering one candle. We'll see how much they're charged to ship it. Anyway, guys, so on that note, I'm going to love and leave you for this evening. I hope everyone had a brilliant, brilliant Saturday. Whatever it is you did today, I hope it was a good one, and we will definitely see you tomorrow. Take care, guys, and stay safe.